we see the highest level of success on social media. It's the highlight reel. But then when we really get down to the nitty gritty, what's happening behind the scenes, we're learning that these people, these people are, are they have an aspiration to be able to better serve their family, but they haven't been doing that. Right. They, they have an aspiration to where 10 years down the line, 15 years down the line, they're, they're, they're talking to their kids and now they're regretful that they didn't spend more time with them. Welcome to the Speak Your Success podcast. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on, successors? And welcome to another episode of the Speak Your Success podcast. I'm Jonathan Jones, and this is a Speak Your Success media production. And I wanted to just kick off today challenging you to consider how do you identify success? What does that really mean to you? And, and the reason why I want to talk about this is because if we're not careful, if we're not careful, then we'll define success based on what other people have said to us, right? We'll define success on the picture by way of our, our, our parents, our siblings, our family, social media. Oh, social media. It's a gift and a curse. But I wanted to bring this up because a while ago I used to do this, this talk. And then I would say, well, if you've always considered success to be getting a high school diploma and then you graduate high school from that point in time you my friend are a success right or you know if you wanted to write a book and then you put that book out you now are also a success so now the question becomes and uh it well the question is how do you define success? If you haven't thought about that or if you haven't sat with that for a little bit and then took the time to come up with that answer, then that's one thing that we want to do. And the reason why is because if we don't take that time and get clear on what success looks like for us, then when we achieve it, we'll never know. Or we'll just continue to be doing like the lazy river, just going around and around and around in a circle and we're not really making any progress. We're just going round and round in the same path, doing the same thing over and over and over. But the other part is, when it comes down to talking about success and when it comes down to uh, really getting clear on what that looks like, I want you to be careful. And I'm saying, I'm giving you all the warning based on, based on me, right? I'm giving you a warning based on things that I've done, things that I've thought, talked about, thought about, uh, sat there and processed through and this really looks like hanging out on social media right I was talking with my brother the other day and we began just to talk about how there's people that we know that are like killing it or as it seems right as it seems on social media it seems like they're really getting after it it seems like they're everywhere doing all the things but then the question that really was being answered through what they're saying was where I am now, would I give it up to have been better at blank? Right? So I want you to think about this. There are people who we see getting after it on social media or so it appears, right? But then when we began to sat at tables and have conversations with these individuals, then they're letting you know that, man, I wish that I had more time with my family. I wish that I had more time to invest into my marriage. I wish this was going better. And it, it, it's really an interesting conversation, an interesting dialogue. Because like I said before, we see the highest level of success on social media. It's the highlight reel. But then when we really get down to the nitty gritty, what's happening behind the scenes, we're learning that these people, these people are, are they have an aspiration to 
be able to better serve their family, but they haven't been doing that, right? They, they have an aspiration to where 10 years down the line, 15 years down the line, they're, they're, they're talking to their kids and now they're regretful that they didn't spend more time with them. That's what success looks like for them looking back. So now, you know, being 10 years, 15 years removed or 10 years, 15 years younger than some of these, 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 these men and these, these women, it's like, hmm, if I know what they're sharing now, right? If I know what they're talking about now and they're regretful of it, they wish they could get this time back. They wish they could spend more time. They could have spent more time with their family. What does that challenge me on? Is success always about the stuff, about the the status, about the accolades, having the biggest following on social media, or, or, or is success about you taking the time to where yes, you've put in a level of work and you continue to put in a level of work. But then taking that break when you feel it in the back of your mind saying, yeah, you, you, you've done enough for today. Go, go spend some time with your family. Go spend some time with your wife. Go spend some time with your husband. Right. So I just want to throw that out there to you. And, you know, I always want to let you all know that we have a training coming up. If you're somebody who's been interested and been wanting to learn more about podcasting. Or you've been wanting to learn more about leveraging your authority as an entrepreneur, as a business owner, and so that more people can learn more about you and market yourself more effectively and more efficiently to be able to generate leads and to convert those leads into paying customers on a consistent basis. Go down in the show notes and go to getpaidwithpodcasting.com. All right, getpaidwithpodcasting.com. And this is the only free training out there that's going to show you how to start a podcast how you can grow it, and how you can monetize it. All right, get paid with podcasting.com. But family, thank you for rocking with us once again on this Speak Your Success Media production. Uh, I'm Jonathan Jones, and y'all, this is Speak Your Success, where we help you speak your success, believe in your greatness, and continue to create the life and business of your dreams. Why would you, and why should you? live any other way.